asked for a bizarre build and kind of done a ton of bazaars, but yeah, we'll get some going. Let's see if that'll help. Well, here's a two person build, a two hero build. I'm not saying that this is the best. I mean, just no ensnares, no nothing. This is just a power through some of it. Get the siren down. 10 PDSs, each on their own buff beams. And you get it done. Earlier today, I got it done about. Yeah, it's not the best build. You do want to have some type of small minion out there. Little bomber is what I'm using right here. But just put some upgrades in the first wave. People like the would like to have cast speed on some of the pets. This is the reason why. Uh, you know, so the summoner has instant uh, upgrades and repairs and stuff. But I mean, we're two minutes in. This is where the are kind of it's timey is last 15 mobs but most importantly just always hit G just always hit G I was trying to think of like better build for someone who's like trying to break into it. I can show what I you know I use when I was breaking into it, but I already have a video of that up on my channel. So I might just build that next. I do like how they hotfix these um, copters up here. Somehow, the uh, they're getting stuck up there, apparently, which is a welcome change. I still use a when I'm doing like survival runs. I still use a wisp just to ensure that. There's any. Mobs lagging behind. Go around it. Wait, this is similar to the one I built previously. The only difference is instead of the siren with the reflect rune, I just put up a three reflect on along the side here. I'd put some here and one like here in front of these four. When it was just like, you know, for Liking King. Because on Liking King it wasn't a bazaar didn't have that um, difficulty enabled. But 
a look at your gear. So, this should be done in about seven minutes, seven and a half minutes. minutes more or thereabouts just don't die die and one of the cockers get stuck or there it was 10 minutes because I died and one of the coppers got stuck up here, right here. So I had to wait for it to despawn, which is an extra minute. So if you're doing ensnares, which you probably should be doing, um, how would that look, right? Six forty seven, not bad. Okay. Do something similar. I was trying to have it where you don't have gear, then what would you do? some of these down. these down. Maybe... Place that down. You know, would this work? Who knows? should work based upon the previous one working it'll just take longer Yeah, I mean, we, have, we haven't lost anything. Two, four, five PDSs. But it's definitely, I would say, a, a lot more difficult. You'd have to focus your energy on getting the ogres and copter ogres down. But maybe four lightning towers is too much.
Yeah, I wouldn't recommend this one. I mean, what if I put up the upgrades in? Will that help? It slows it down. See if it, it helps. So if the air is there, there, and there... Oh, godly rune. There... It's the... Something here. This is where I put it on survival. I put a siren right here and then put PDSs around it. I just barely bought this. My last one. Now I got it. From the update. So if I were to put walls down, I don't know. Puts walls down. Um or build each lane separately, what would that build look like? I mean, this is just too good to not put it in a snare for both those lanes. Maybe put a couple PDSs down for air, or right here, because you can have some line of sight right there, whenever that comes into it, so for the PDS. I don't know, let's build something out that's a little bit different then. PDS spam. They're all dying. Seven twenty six, still not bad. So an eight minute run. I do like I think harpoons right here could be what really good. Right up here. I could cover both those lanes right there, harpoons. Then a siren right here will be able to get those PD that PDS right there. Eight minutes. Nice. 
Hey Mel, how are you doing? Someone asked on my channel for a bizarre build, so I'm trying to think of one for him. That isn't just PDS spam. We go here, get that lane too. Where's a fun spot to put to PDS? Right here, where I'm standing. Up high. Oh, up here. Like up here and stuff. Higher. <laughs> Can you get him off the map, basically? Okay. Some of the snares down. You have me intrigued. I'll like up here on this roof or something. Make it. No, I don't. Yeah, it's not public. Eight. By the way, I've never done this build before, but I have no, no uh, hesitations to think that it won't work. Yeah, I I was just joining to do a. Uh, this will definitely take more. <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. There are a lot of uh, people in public right now. I did get up to uh, wave 100 Forsaken Temple yesterday. If, when I, once I saw the patch notes, I was like, sure, I'll stay in and 
knock that out. So I don't have to do it again. <laughs> Will kick leeches. Three still had to be kicked. Like, the amount of people, I, I was doing a throne room, just public, and he was in there um, with his rock, you know, summoner, he didn't even like move from the login place to stand on the, the auras. It's like, the least you could do is like, not be deliberate, like, be some value, like, and then he didn't even change over to a a DPS, so he was just sitting there while we're DPSing the boss, not buffing anything, not doing anything. I'm like, awesome. I've definitely had that experience before. I think this one ran better than even with just PDS spam. Or is it just me thinking that ran any smoother? Well, yeah, they could be, if they're new to the game and they just, they're, you know, joining up new publics, so they could just be going through their gear. Still flying. Well, here's a testament of whether or not it's actually valid. So, put down two spiders on the summoner for the bubble. Even to like G up and make squire noises. This is definitely slower as a build, but it holds just fine. The exploration. Uh, Alt H, this screenshot, bizarre. Alt H. Have you noticed a lot less um, rifted drops on Bazaar, or is it just me? Maybe move this back? I don't know. Like, that's the thing about this hill right here. Ancient mines. Yeah. I always 
mostly Ave King, the ones that I need the runes off of. And then I've just been doing like Castle Armory and Forsaken Temple for the most part. Zars put in there. Yeah, I don't like how this guy gets stuck now because of the ones down there. So, definitely, I mean, you still need a DPS hero. Before they were stuck on that ledge. I've still seen them today stuck over here and now stuck up over there, depending on placement. 10 minutes and 49 seconds, not bad. Well, do have to call it. Mel has been fun chatting. I do have to start work though. So, I'm just trying to get a quick video out and hopefully this will help people to get uh, some bar bizarre runs in. So, anyhow, talk to you guys later.